Hello everyone. I hope and pray that everyone is well at home. Life continues in different ways. Uh, the time doesn't stop because of the quarantine of the virus. Neither the things that we're supposed to do as our believers. We need to continue to work uh, in our faith. That is why uh, I would like to ask you a few things, actually three things. The first one is uh, to pray. I know that uh, it's an obligation that we have, of, as part of who we are as a believers, to pray. But many times, because you have to work, you have to attend events, we don't have uh, quality time to, to pray. But now that we are at home, uh, I would like you to use the time that you have to pray. For those who live alone, it's, it's easy, you know, you decide to pray and you pray. But what I would like to ask you, especially those who have the whole family together, is to pray as a family. Normally, in other situations, always we have an excuse uh, to don't pray as a family. Somebody's in a game, somebody's working, somebody's out. But now, there's no excuse. Everyone is at home. Then, pray as a family. The second thing is to read. To have uh, this time on a specific part of the day to, to read, especially the things uh, that are related to, to our faith. I will ask you to recommend to read the Gospels, four of them, or well, at least one of them. But also, uh, uh, I would like to, to recommend two books. The first one is The Story of the Soul. The Therese of Lisier, The Little Flower. Beautiful book. It's her autobiography. And the second one is The, the Screw Tape Letters of C.S. Lewis. A beautiful book as well. In the end of this, this time, uh, you will come out with more knowledge and of regard our faith. Lastly, part of our uh, commitment to our faith is to know to know more and more regard our faith and doing so sometimes we have, we have questions we have doubts and what we normally would recommend to you is just go to the parish talk to your priest ask your questions and we will answer if we can uh, but now you're at home I am here. What I want, I would like to recommend to you, I will ask you, is that in this time, and that will not take any time from you, will be a take, take a lot of time for me, but that you will ask to me your questions. And we, in the parish, we will try to answer. With the help of God, toward the end of this time, we will come out uh, better than we were before. Thank you so much for, for being part of this beautiful parish. Thank you so much for being part of uh, St. Catherine. God bless you.